What up, y'all? It's Mel and Keisha back with another Eat and Chat. I'm Mel. I'm Keisha. And together we're walking the Fat Woman Shoes. How y'all doing? MK Saints, Visitors, and Passive Foods. Tonight's Eat and Chat, we have takeout. Yeah. Rib, fries, and okra. That's sauce that you don't need. You say? We drinking on that good old H2O. And the coldest water bottle, a.k.a. Big Girl. Y'all already know what I say. Y'all forget your one. But should not say if you're in a crisis, know that. When the meat ain't good, you got to use sauce, okay? Well, I can't use sauce, so it is what it is. That's on you. <laughs> All right. Um, yeah. Kick it. Kick the grapes. God is good. God is good. Thank you for the love of our church. See, bless your holy name. Bless your prayers. Amen. 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 So what's going on with you guys tonight? Let us know what y'all eating. And if y'all eat with us, also let us know what's going on in y'all neck of the woods. In this container here, I got the fries and the fried okra. Okay. Uh, go ahead. Uh, get it. We need um, a spoon to like put that on the stuff or whatever. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, I don't even know. I think it's very good. Oh, well, it's a little smoke than they normally do. No, I don't need that. Alright, let's, let's go. I'm going to leave. I'm gonna leave. It's tender than it normally is. It's what? Tender than it normally is. Really? Yeah. Oh. And it's coming out long. It's real evil. Yeah. Well, how y'all? How are y'all doing tonight? We've been running. Thank you. We're getting off before the rain. He didn't rain. We did get out before the rain, though. But it rain, though. In the sense, yeah, we did get out before the rain. But it didn't rain. Tomorrow, we are supposed to be. 30 degrees colder than we are now. We yeah. had beautiful weather today, 75. Mm -hmm. Could not beat that one. I'm sorry, y'all. Y'all want some? I know they find the salt in there, but it got to be delicious. I think it's called the French chef fries. Mm -hmm. It's the fries, the barbecue sauce, the cheese, and some kind of meat on it. Oh, my goodness. And then my just sons rub it in. get to make their own. You just rubbing it in. So they have extra meat on there and all that. It is all the same. I think what saves them is their sides. Yeah, before I, um. Started doing keto, they fried, and they have they a pretty good sauce. And everything. You mean stuff like this? Let me see that spoon. You want some barbecue sauce? Yeah, sure. Mm mm. So that can't have no sauce? No, of course can't. When you don't, even when you don't want to restrict yourself, 
You have to because mm -hmm. you don't want to mess up. I don't, I don't want to do that. Roll it. Bro, no. I think tomorrow, if I'm up to it in the weather and it's not really raining mm -hmm. bad, I'm going to go in the hood to another barbecue shack mm -hmm. that does really well in our area. She see they do very well. Yeah, they be here. They be, I'm they talking be. about as far as customers. And oh, okay, okay, okay. I thought they were talking because about customers. I haven't been there in years. That's you true. know, we haven't been there in years. That's you know, true. we came, we change. went there when we first came here. Mm -hmm. But the barbecue wasn't hitting on nothing like that. They do have an awesome corn dish, though. Yeah. It is awesome. They corn, I ain't gonna lie, they corn is just so flipping good. I'm just. Man, this red toast, y'all ain't got no regular toast, sliced bread. No, 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 yeah, it's toast. Mm. Did you have to do that? <laughs> Did you have to do that? It's tough. Oh, yeah. I just need a slice of bread. I guess that's the closest I'm going to get to it. Let's see, whenever I want ribs, this is where I go. I go here. I don't know why. Because they good. And they so? Nope. Not always. No. Maybe not always, but most of the time they go. And it's meat. I don't have to eat no side of the meat. Eat the meat and be happy. Man. I guess you eat it enough. You get used to it. Man, you don't know. See, since they started working out, I think we haven't had everything on the menu. I ain't had the full four. Oh, and I don't want it. What? Pork, pork is real fatty. I don't eat everybody pork It's not smoked. I don't think that pork pork can't own nothing. Maybe we're going to throw some barbecue sauce on it, but you got to be ready for that fat. Because it's real fatty. Like, you can see the fat in it. Mm -hmm. What you say, Put this in the pork and then. Look at this face. Down here. They ain't. One thing that I thought was good from them was they baked potato. And uh, they had some beans. That was good too. Yeah, I'm running it all in the barbecue sauce like that. Well, it's sitting in the barbecue sauce, and then I'm baking it. I'm giving it a batch look. With the I don't sauce. Look, I'm good. And I'm baking it. Then I let it come out and drip down a little bit. You know how when you be in the shower and you be dripping wet, <laughs> cause that's how this meat is. <laughs> it's dripping wet. So.
I got to let some of that sauce drip off there. You know and how then the meat say, juices go into the sauce. No, so that song. improves the sauce a little bit. I shall overcome. Yes, I will. Okay. I'm overcoming. I'm overcoming. I'm overcoming it, you know. Because, y'all, I went, I mean, a after we got up, we watched some TV or whatever, and, you know, I don't sleep like that, like talking about it. So I was up till about 1.30, 2 o'clock. All them hunger pains started hitting me. I'm like, oh, no. And I told her I like the snack at night. I was like, no, who no. knew? Oh, no. I drank me two bottles of water, and I was I like, you know what? Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. I, was working. I, saw I made myself go to sleep. I ain't even hear you, bitch. I ain't hear you. I hear you over there with that. Because the meat was kind of juicy right now. It's good today. But they're not consistent. That's probably because they have different people that do it. Different people that probably won't put their own stank on, you know. This is true. But today we went to the Wells and our tingle. And they all just did. How y'all say the man they buck me? They ain't buck me. Buck on the white time. Forget the day on it. They on it today. My son mm -hmm. won that work either. That's good. So if this day I work, we can't eat good. <laughs> I make you think they back there cooking it now. Right. Some days I be in the eating mood, some days I don't. I mean, it's still got one of them. And I need six. That's good. I'm done. Are you done, Lapid? I'm done. This is my last one. Gotta roll it in this sauce. Look at that. Let it drip. I'm not playing with I'm not playing Let with the dog. She has all drip rolled in that barbecue sauce piece. You see that? Nope. Oh, look nothing. at the, the grease from the meat. Look at that. That's all on the Whoa, grease. Look mm -hmm. at that. Okay, I can see what. Mm hmm. Mm -mm. I wonder who cooked these today. I he the bar, he the rib, he was off that day we went out. Mm-hmm. Cool. Oh, so Jim the bar, the rib man. All right. Always. So when he off, I don't know. So y'all need to let us know when he's there. So like when we want ribs. So when, when he not there, there we'll get it. And it's not only good. But when Mr. Jim do it, it's his fault. You know what I mean? So you know, Jim so the rib man. He has the extra seasoning on it when it goes to the pit. But this is tender, so he put a little more time on it, or he turned it up. We all we always put a little more time, or sometimes when he in a rush, he turns it up. Hmm. I knew it was something because these mugs tender. All right, that's enough for y'all secrets. Yeah, I mean, he's doing it. You know? Yeah, he's doing it. I mean, it's not really a secret because a lot of people that uh oh man that do ribs will do that, you know so. They fish fry day, 
they be packed. I'm going to have to go on a Friday fish. Really? Friday? We went, we went to go get some fish. Right? Because I wanted to say, say fish. I'm like, because, you know. Fish the Friday, they, they whole parking lot was parked yeah, out. Yeah, they be like, man, y'all got, y'all don't understand the fish is good. The fish is good. So I said, all right, we going to go there. We went there and it was completely out. They had been, they sold out of fish in 45 minutes. Record oh. time. That was record time for them. It was gone in 45 minutes. And what time did that start? Mean? 5 o'clock. All right, all right, we up at 4.30. We went. I was like, what in the world? It was so packed out. Mel had to park all the way to the back. I'm like, damn. I don't like parking all the way to the back, you know. I'm scared. You know, I'm just playing. But I still don't like parking all the way to the back. I like to see, you know, what's going on, you know. But they had so many people. Up in there, I was like, man, I know they ain't got no fish. I'm saying to myself, I know they ain't got no fish. I know they don't, because they had people that was don't, don't going in there and coming out. Just They was going in and coming out. Like you just said, they was going in. And y'all got that fish up there. Y'all y'all got some fish up there. No, ain't got no fish. But you know what? I, I'll see y'all next week. I'll see y'all next week. It was, I mean, it was so packed. It was like, as if to say there were people that were outside waiting for yeah. five o'clock to hit. Yeah. You know, it was like they was waiting, like they was outside in their cars or even in there waiting for five o'clock to hit so they can get lots of fish. That's how parked out they were. And I was like, Lord, I ain't never seen them parked out like that before. No, no, no. I, I ain't never seen them parked out like that before. No, no, no. I gotta get me a uh, Another straw thing. I bit my uh straw. That's why I make that sound. That's messed up. And I, I bit it on. I don't know why I bit it. I know it was an accident, but it is what it is. Yeah, you you like picking with me or something? Yo, know, mm, mm, mm. and you don't never do that. Y'all know her. She don't never get mm, mm, mm. She don't never do that. I'll cut the salt. Right, right, right. Show you was right, right. Show you right. But I need eight for the night. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done for the night. I ate my lunch already. Which was my meal prep, my chicken and veggies. I ate that at what time? I ate that at about two thirty. Yeah, about two thirty. So yeah, and I'm eating my dinner now. Curtis is like, Mama, when we get home, me and Dwayne gotta go straight to bed because it's late. I said, Boy, it's only five forty. He was like, What? He's like, It's dark as it is, Mom. I'm like, Boy, it's five forty. It's it's not dark. I mean, it, it's not late. It's not late. He's like, man, mommy, you serious? I'm like, I'm serious. It's only five forty, sir. So, uh, he's like, uh, uh-uh. uh. He said, y'all about to eat right when we got home. Y'all about to eat right now, and it's so early. I'm like, why not? And she's telling me, you know, it's my fault that we eat like real early and stuff. But like I told her, I'm on a schedule. I got a game plan. I got a game plan and. I refuse to mess that up, you I refuse. I got my game plan. Forget that. You know, she lucky we don't eat at no, uh, she lucky we don't eat for five, you know what I'm saying? For five o'clock. And just if you eat a snack prepare at a meal for five yes, o'clock. I can. You know I can. Don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Because you know what my meal is for tomorrow. Well, I got my meal prep. What I'm going you? to eat. You were sitting there talking about brunch, yo. Oh, I'm gonna eat go brunch home. at one o'clock. So I'm gonna we, do a video of me making those. What you think? I'm, I'm gonna tell y'all. Cook. If y'all see the video, y'all know. Morning. We were supposed to, but I ain't want. I didn't. I didn't want to hit seven o'clock, y'all. I, I'm just gonna be honest. I ain't want to hit seven. I ain't want to hit seven o'clock. And if we came home and started cooking, we'd hit seven o'clock. I ain't want to hit seven o'clock. You know, while I was eating. So that's why we got. Excuse me, got these ribs. But since we ain't going to wear tomorrow, we got ribs. Since we ain't going to wear tomorrow, we cook early. Because 
Yeah, I, I gotta do I gotta do a video. Yeah, I gotta do a video tomorrow. Tomorrow is Thursday, so I have to do a video tomorrow. You ain't going to show y'all what I do. Oh, well, you ain't going nowhere tomorrow. You ain't going nowhere tomorrow. It's gonna be raining. You ain't going nowhere. Who you do not like to drive. She don't like to drive in the rain. Tell old woman, you know. Show old lady. I don't she like, like to drive, drive in the rain because people don't know how to drive. That's in the rain. true, but still. My old lady. And I've been in several bad, a few bad accidents. Yeah. And I don't blame you for not wanting to be in the rain, old lady. I'm and one of them was in the rain, so. Oh, damn. Not the one where you uh, messed up your leg, huh? Mm-mm. Oh. Dumb fuck went to sleep. No, in the rain? Oh, oh, that, oh, okay. Jeez. Ugh. Ooh, something like some high. Man. I started watching the most hated woman in America. Most what? Hated woman in America. Who is it? The atheist woman. I don't know her. Old dude. Or something like that. I don't know her. She don't want to take prayer out of school. Oh, I don't want to know that bitch. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna call it what it is. Cause once y'all took prayer out of schools, y'all opened up the y'all opened up the gates for these children to have all these truancies and have the parents paying. You know, instead Wait, of giving these children. Yeah. They opened up the gates for all this truancy and having the parents pay for what these children doing. You know, as far as like with them skipping school, we gotta pay for that when they skip school. But you know, that instead of putting that on that. Taking prayer out of school opened up the gates for a lot of dumb, unnecessary shit. How about that? I can go with that better than truancy. Girl. Yeah, all right. I went to Catholic school and cut school. They weren't doing all that with you. Tell me they weren't praying that. We had a Catholicism class. Then depending on what season it is, we used... Every Friday we went to church. We said prayers in the morning. That's because you was being rebellious. No, I wasn't. I just was tired. I ain't feel like going to school. You was being a little rebellious. A little rebellious thing. A little young. young thing. That is not why I used to. I just told you. I was just tired. I didn't feel like going to school. I didn't cut school. I was school. And for me to cut school at that school, that was a bold move. I was a good girl. I didn't cut school. You know why I was a bold move? Why? Because there was only like 33 children in each class. Mm. So, come on now. You got 33 students in each class. You think your teacher ain't going to miss you? 300 students in the school? You think you ain't going to be missed? Yeah, you're going to be missed. Oh, yeah. Especially when your siblings go to school. Hello, where's, uh, where's it, girl? <laughs> where's Miss Melina? <laughs> and I know my little snitchy sister. <clears throat> I don't know. Yeah, I remember the first time I cut school. Just so happened to be a day my mama didn't feel like going to work either. Boy, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. what you doing here? Oh, nothing. nothing. I'm just sleeping. <laughs> Coaching. Because the school called. And it was like, well, you know she ain't coming to school today. My mama was like, what? At first, I hid from her, but oh, she came man. back. So after she came back, I just like, forget it. And I came out my hiding spot. Yeah, I did. Like, what could she have possibly thought I would have been? <laughs> I guess that's why she came back to that room. Water is your best friend. Lord Jesus, water is your best friend, on Tito. I guess after they told her that, she went made her calls. You know, Mama, she over there by you? No. Uh, Vi, old girl went to school? Yeah. Well, she can't be no one but in here. Hmm. You know? My best friend went to school and I'm not by my grandma's house. I don't have no other friends that she really know of. So the only place I could have been was in the house. 
And he was hiding in the house. Uh-huh. Mm. Mm-hmm. Under the bookshelf. You little enough to hide under the bookshelf, too. No, but my daddy had made us custom bookshelves for our room. And the bookshelf was like, like that, like, you know, like four you feet. You do know I've been in your house, right? But you we, know, had, we took you them know. down, though, yeah. by then. They was in our bedroom. And the way the bookshelves was, was they, they were caddy counter. There was one here and one there. That's so what I did. Was like that. So what I did was I tacked up a sheet. And I was down up under in the bookshelves. I had the teddy bears and stuff over there. And I was behind the sheet. But you know, man, you you about this tall, so you know you can get away with that. You can get away with that. Was you this tall when you was in Catholic school or you were shorter? You probably you probably just had God from being able to walk under this TV. Whatever, y'all. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Y'all be blessed and have a good one. We, we love safe we out there all this with video. all this winter weather, right. fires right. and whatnot. We praying for uh, all of you guys out there. The rain. Yeah. Y'all be careful. We hope y'all enjoyed this video. We love y'all. Y'all take care. Be all blessed. All y'all with illnesses. We praying for your, right. your recovery. Be the recovery. Mama DD, Tima, and anybody else. Stephanie. I, Stephanie. She was, she was feeling under the weather. Mama needed to make us some soup. Oh, Lord. She going to curse you all now. She going she gonna to curse you all. Anyway. <laughs> we love y'all. Y'all take care. Be blessed. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. Thank y'all for coming and rock, watching and rocking with us. To our new family members, we appreciate y'all for coming and rocking with us and being a part of the MK Saints family. You heard me? Until next time. We gonna plant you down and dig you later because I know y'all can pick up what we are putting down here. Peace. <laughs> I know she didn't just play with me. <laughs> and you talk about my fingers? Your fingers long, man. Do it. I did that because it went like that. Do, 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> See, look, they still gonna do it again. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Love y'all. Peace.